So, you want to be a millionaire. I don't know you from Adam, but first of all, I've got to say, the fact that you've got the curiosity to even be watching this video, you're halfway there to the potential of releasing your aspirations to become a millionaire. So keep watching. To have a definition of what a millionaire is, and, and lots of people have different definitions. Um, the simplest definition of a millionaire might be your assets, less your liabilities, i.e. any money that you owe. Uh, equals your net worth and that's a very simplistic way of looking at it so that your net worth if it's a million you're a net worth millionaire um, for me after having lots of discussions with lots of different friends about being a millionaire I have, have defined it as not necessarily always about money and for me it's very much about how I choose to spend my time what values I have and how I spend my time around those values and I think if you can put your hand on your heart and say I today can choose what I'm doing and tomorrow and I don't need to go to work nine to five sit in the traffic earn the money to pay for that car that house uh, if you're totally in control um, then that is a priceless activity and that's about being in my mind a social millionaire how you choose to spend your time and that transpires through a, a variety of things how you live and what you do and what you spend and what you invest so that was that's a little bit of a, a, a detour into into the main things so in terms of about uh, millionaires and I've sort of put it into several um, definitions and my focus is property because obviously uh, my background is in property investments so one of the sort of um, early definitions of what a millionaire is, a net property millionaire, is essentially you've got assets of a million pound without the main resident property. So you're not living in a house and it's worth a millionaire, million, sorry. Uh, so a net property millionaire is somebody who's got assets of a million pounds without their main residential property. And usually that isn't earning you any income. The second type of millionaire is a million pound property owner. And that is essentially what it means, says. It means you live in a property worth a million pound. And really that sort of equates to having a, you know, a bar of gold. It doesn't give you an income and there's a burden to insure it, to look after it. Um, and it won't give you an income as I say and it usually retains its value and it keeps pace with inflation so that is a million pound property owner so lots of people um, around us live in million pound houses but uh, aren't millionaires um, it, essentially and then the other one is income producing million uh, property owner or a passive income and really that is that you've got property or several properties that uh, once you've taken the assets uh, liabilities off the assets equate to a million pounds and they make you a passive income so really that is a, um, a income producing millionaire property owner so that's essentially what we are we've got properties that are worth several million pounds and they're making us a passive income so we don't need to be there uh, still maintain that passive income have an income and lead a life where you choose to spend your time and essentially that's what it's all about is about how you spend your time as, as mentioned earlier now um, some of the tips are uh, those three categories I gave you about the net worth millionaire the millionaire property owner and the passive income millionaire all require different skills and traits and patience is obviously one of them these are normally long-term uh, investments and I think one of the part of tips I would give you is to do some research and one of the books that um, I've referenced in the past is Rich Dad Poor Dad and in there it talks about sort of marginal gains and doing things differently it's not the only book it's not the best book but it's definitely a book that you should read and possibly get some ideas from if you're looking at um, choosing your time and how you spend it and becoming a property millionaire or a millionaire per se so please could you subscribe or like uh, and keep watching thank you bye